back to the channel. It is Saturday, uh, November the 19th, and um, my name is Erica. If you are into all things home decor and lifestyle, then you are in the right place. So um, I wanted to come on today and start the vlog because I just received a delivery from Crate and Barrel, and you guys, it is my coffee table. Um, I waited for about two, two and a half months for this coffee table to come in because it was on back order for quite some time. Um, the last few things that I'm waiting for from Crate and Barrel are my um, office desk and my um, bookshelf and um, bookshelf and it's like my file cabinet, it's like all in one. I'm waiting on all of that to come in and that should be here um, come January. But I wanted to come on and show the coffee table to you guys and show how it looks in the area. I'm absolutely in love with it. So let me turn you guys around so I can share my new coffee table with you all. All right, guys, here it is. I think she looks absolutely beautiful in this space. I absolutely love um, the fact that it's very modern looking. So this is the large cap ivory cement coffee table from Crate and Barrel. Um, they do have another one like this that is um, smaller, but I wanted to get the biggest one that they had because I wanted to be able to fill this space appropriately, especially since I'm not going to get any um, accent chairs to go in here. I think that this is just absolutely beautiful. I think it was definitely worth the wait. Um, like I said, it was on back order. So it's finally here. I have not decided, um, or rather I have not um, found the uh, centerpiece that is going to go on here or the coffee table decor rather. So I'm definitely, I kind of have in mind what I think I want on the coffee table but I've been so busy and so focused on Christmas decor shopping that I have not um, really just been focused on that. And for right now, I just love the way that it is and it's, you know, not having anything on it and being able to enjoy just the um, coffee table itself. I think it's absolutely beautiful. So let me go from this angle, I'm gonna stand behind the sofa so that you guys can see it from from this angle but I am absolutely in love even more so now that I'm able to see it in person and so for me I was trying to decide if I wanted to get a square coffee table or a circle coffee table and I think this is so so fitting for this space she is absolutely gorgeous. So I am going to go and get some little temporary items and put on here and just kind of try it out and see how I like it. So I'm going to go and grab those items and I will be right back. All right, y'all. So I added this little vase set on top of the coffee table and I like it. I like this little vase set here. Um, I don't know if I will keep it permanently, but I do like the way that it looks so far. And looking at it here in the, in the camera, it's not centered properly. So let's see. Let's see if I can get this centered just right. Let's see how that looks now. Okay, that looks better. I feel like I need to bring it forward some. Let's do that now. Yeah, I think that that's cute. I think that's really cute. Um, like I said, that wasn't what I had in mind, but when I cleared the um, decor off of the entryway table so that I could decorate it for, um, for fall, um, these two were actually on there, but I feel like I like it better on the coffee table. 
at least for right now, this is what I'm going to use. And I think that it looks good. So I know y'all hear runts in the background barking. I put him outside for a second until I was able to get this um, area situated. But yeah, guys, I'm so in love. So I'm gonna go ahead and let him in. And um, I also went to Target yesterday, as you guys saw in the opening. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and um, and get him situated and then come back and share with you guys what I picked up from Target. Okay, y'all, I'm back. So I went and grabbed all of the stuff that I got from Target yesterday. But first I wanted to share with y'all. So Starbucks has been major self care for me for this week. Y'all, these past two, three weeks have just been really, really taxing at work. Um, a little bit more so than normal. And so for me, I try to figure out ways to implement self-care and Starbucks was it for me every day this week. Um, I had it every day except for Friday. I did not have it yesterday, but I did go on, I think it was Thursday, they were giving out the red holiday cups. And so I just wanted to share that I did get mine. And this is my first time ever getting a, um, holiday cup from uh, Starbucks. So it came free with my purchase and it is the 25 years of holiday cup cheer um, cup that they were, were giving out. So I'm sure these went like hotcakes because who doesn't love a free Starbucks cup? So let me turn you guys a little bit more that way. Okay, so, um, so yeah, I wanted to share that with y'all. I'm gonna put it in my sink so I can uh, wash it when I wash my dishes um, later on this evening. But like I said, I wanted to come on here and share with you guys what I picked up from Target. And y'all, I couldn't do any filming. They had some really good stuff, um, especially in the back of the store. A lot of good Christmas items that I didn't even realize was back there. So thank goodness I had to get other things because I ended up stumbling upon this area and it was just like Christmas Central. So I was super excited and I took my time and just went through there. But before I got to the Christmas items, um, my family will be here on Wednesday um, for Thanksgiving. And so I wanted to make sure that we had us some wine. So um, Stella Rosa is my absolute favorite wine if I'm going to have it. So I picked up, let me put this one down. I picked up two bottles of the Stella Rosa Black. Got two bottles of um, this wine from Target. And then I've also been wanting to try the Stella Rosa Red. So I wanted to make sure that we had some wine because we're gonna do the whole, um, not campfire, but I can't even think of the name of it right now. And I'm looking right at it out on my back. Um, on my back patio but we are going to um light up the um not the grill shit y'all i can't even think right now that's how tired i am i'll probably even look tired on the on the video this week and i, I also noticed that i uh did a whole nother opening intro because i forgot that i opened up um yesterday before going into Target, so yeah, whatever. Y'all know what I mean, but <laughs> I'm always saying welcome to the channel anyway, so not a big deal, but a uh, fire pit. So my fire pit, we are going to fire that up while my, my, while my mom, my daughter, and my sister are here, and then I'm gonna have my granddaughter and my great niece, so it's gonna be a good time. So I just wanted to have a variety of beverages. Um, I'm also gonna have some eggnog and my sister, I think she's going to make a couple of mixed drinks. So like I said, at least we'll have some variety. But speaking of my babies, I did want to get them some matching holiday pajamas. Look y'all, how cute is that for little Nyla and Cody? So I picked them up some matching PJs. They were only $11 um, for each set. So I thought that they were super cute. I also got 
got them these cute little matching elf headbands. <laughs> How cute are those? So I figured they could wear them around the house with their pajamas and, you know, give them something to really be excited about. And since we are going to be doing all this cooking, I also wanted to pick them up a little Play-Doh kitchen creation set. Both of them absolutely love Play-Doh and I feel like this is something that we can easily clean up. So I just wanted to have them something to occupy their time and um, something that they could do together besides, you know, just watching TV or, you know, playing with each other and being outside in the yard because the weather's going to be really great while they're here. So that's a plus. We'll be able to be outside and enjoy ourselves and not freeze entirely. Um, you guys know that my gray comes in with a vengeance. So I dye my hair like maybe once every month and a half to two months. So I needed some more hair dye. I always get the Jet Black by Garnier Nutrice. And it doesn't make my, my hair hard or anything. So I just like to have some extra, extra um, sets of dye. So I'm gonna let him pick that up. And then I did get the last, finally the last few items of Christmas decor that I'm gonna buy for this year. You guys know that I was still looking for a pillow for my bed and I don't have a whole lot of red for Christmas this year. So I thought that this little red and white snowflake pillow was just too cute and i'm gonna cut the tag off and all of that when it's time but it was only ten dollars and they had plenty of them but i thought that this was adorable and you know i'm excited to have pops of color throughout the house for the holidays because you guys know that i am a neutral girl but yeah like i said i didn't have much red so i thought that this would be super cute to put on my bed. And I also found this cute uh, snowballs for sale sign. It was only $5, you guys. And I love it so much because it is black and white. And y'all know that's my going theme in my house. So it's perfect. I already know where I'm gonna put it. So I cannot wait to um, put everything up for the fall and start decorating for the Christmas season. Super excited for that, but yeah, only five bucks. I thought that was a really good deal. And then I also found another sign, and I know where this one's going too, um, for $5 as well. It just says um, holiday greens, wreaths, swags, and garlands. And it even has like a little piece up here with this little velvet bow. I just thought that this one was absolutely beautiful as well. And the other sign I found in the Target dollar spot, this one I found in the back of the store. So like I said, I'm so happy that I went back there because yeah, they have so much more, so many more things to offer. So let's see, that was all that I picked up from Target. Yeah, and y'all, like I said, those stores were so busy. I will not be going back into another major store until after Thanksgiving if I have to go. Um, there's really no need. I'm gonna time it just right because like all the stores are just so busy right now, but it's that, that time of the season. So I was happy to get my hands on these items. So I'm gonna go ahead and get all of this stuff put up and I will check in with you guys here in just a bit. Hey guys, so my mom and I, say hey mama. So we just got to Tokyo Harbor because I was craving me some hibachi. So we are about to order our food and I will show you guys uh, what it looks like when it comes out. All right, see y'all soon. All right y'all, so dinner is served. I ate a, a good amount of my rice, but I wanted to share with y'all before I started to dig in. I just got my shrimp on the plate. And mom has the same thing. Hers looks a lot neater than my plate. We got to put everything together. But we're going to go ahead and enjoy this meal, you guys.